<laughs> I can say whatever I want. I don't have to play anyone. All right, we're back. Ostrich Glue versus Dexter, winner's finals. I like the, uh, like, I don't know if Dexter's officially changed his tag to only having one E now, but I like it because it, like, differentiates him from the, like, ten other Dexters there are. Yeah, there's quite a few. It's kind of like Karma. There's too many of them. Well, he changed his tag to something else weird. I don't remember what. Uh, Harem King. King but of it, even. <laughs> yeah, he's still Karma, though. Definitely still karma. All oh right, God. so that was that was an early stock. Yeah. So while we were talking about dumb names, uh, a stock was taken swiftly and without mercy. Wow. He actually can get guaranteed forward tilt after that. That's awful. That's terrifying. I mean, it's it's one forward tilt, but yeah. So this matchup has historically been very heavily Dexter favored, except for that one set at Odyssey. Yeah, I remember that. Where that Glue was, uh, won somehow. barely in he winner's it semis. Out. And then Dexter beat everyone in losers. Yep. Including me. Like, really, really badly, too. It was, uh... I don't know if he even dropped a single game, honestly. Yeah, it's looking like it's probably gonna, you know, go Dexter's favor unless Glue adjusts pretty quick. Yeah, we'll see. We're only a minute in. Yeah, but Dexter's neutral game is... Oh look at that! <laughs> I mean, I know I was about to say his neutral game is great and precise, and then he just threw a charge forward smash, but it worked, so maybe it is so great and precise. It is, and then he also can read so well. He just knows. He has years of experience. He just knows what people want to do. Plays every Smash game. Yeah. Except for 64, I think. But yeah. All right, so yeah, Glue's been DIing in on the down throw and then uh, nairing to combo break, and I think Dexter's caught on to it already. He down smashed instead of trying to re-grab. Yeah. Yeah, Dexter, uh, he rarely falls for the same trick twice. Yep. Or if he does, he'll usually adjust it by the next game. Oh. One thing about Dexter's neutral is that his, like, his dash dancing is so good. And more specifically, his, like, dash wave dash back. I don't know dash, what wave dash back, I don't know tilt. what it is about his in particular, but it's just it's so much more convincing that he's gonna dash in. I don't know why. It's just a timing thing or like what's he trying to do? Pivot F smash? Yeah, I don't know why. I mean the charge one worked early. So yeah, maybe but the, he just the last one again. didn't. But no, uh, his uh, his neutral is ridiculous. It is. It really is. His punish game is super good too. And, you know, that's not even talking about character-specific things like Meta Knight's got a good down tilt or whatever. He can... He'll, he'll get in your head with any character. Oh, yeah. Glue's no slouch either, though. Yeah, Glue plays a very safe neutral. Right. That was a good read. Very uh, spacing heavy. Yep. Yeah, that's how I would describe it, Which, too. Which, it works against most people, but... Dexter's got all that experience. He's got, I would argue, probably better spacing. Yeah, I think so. It makes it rough to yeah, play like, that Yeah, look at that. Style. He couldn't even shield grab that down here. He didn't even try, but he couldn't have. Meta Knight's dash attack is so weird. It clanks. With it clanks with everything. everything. Literally the, everything. The only move he has. It clanks. Yep. But it clanks with aerials, which is so, so bizarre. It's so awful. You try to jump over him and do an aerial to catch him while he's running under you, and if he does dash attack, it doesn't work. Yeah. Like, imagine, like, Falcon Stomp. He can clank that with dash attack. Yeah, Ganon That's Stomp, too. Literally any <laughs> move. So the percent dumb. doesn't matter. Uh, just I'm goes against sure. every rule of Smash. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he could clank the, uh, the Ganondorf down taunt. <laughs> I bet he could. Man, the, the instant dimensional cave is like... It's like a built-in... It's like the Meta Knight knee, but he like automatically like overshoots with it. He doesn't even need to like run farther. And he can like, go backwards if he wants to. Yeah, he doesn't even need to like do an attack out of it. He can move with it and then have like almost zero lag after Yep. I missed the days when Dexter didn't use that tool. <laughs> I died a lot less. Yep. Well, yeah, a little slow on that dash attack. Or not the dash attack. The grab. Okay, Glue has no jumps left, but he lands. He's Kirby. He's always got a pocket jump left, even when you think he doesn't. Misses the combo there. 
Oh, that was a that nice. was yeah, that was slick. It would have even caught like so if if Dexter expected the down tilt, which I was. Um, down smash lingers a little longer than down tilt does, so he would have gotten hit anyway if he tried to like dash dance grab it. So that was really smart. Doesn't get the stock though, unfortunately. Yeah, that's one of those. Yeah, that'll do it though. That was some dash back di. Yep. Dash back di. That's a good one. good word for it. It happens a lot. It happens Otherwise known as Bermuda Triangle di, where you've never seen or heard from again. <laughs> yeah, that one's that one's good too. That was a little, a little more funny. Usually more reserved for uh, more hideous cases of bad DI. <laughs> yeah. Dying yeah. from Martha Dare on center stage, that sort of thing. <laughs> okay, Glue is holding on to this stock really well. Yeah. That's an important thing as a floaty. I mean, 24% is nothing to laugh at, but... Eh, it's He's a little funny. I would laugh at it a little. I would chuckle. Against a player like Dexter. Against a character like Meta Knight. Yeah, he's still he's still in. Because look at that. He gets like though. two or three throws, and now he's back. They're at the same percent now. And yep. he's just carrying him away. God. Oh. God, that's hard to do, honestly. I have trouble doing that. Well, that was weird. No impact lands from the uh, side cutter. Can't tell if it was intentional. Probably he might have not. been trying to do some tricky stuff to get on stage, but I think instant dimensional cape there would have caught you would have killed Kirby, but instead Dexter tried to fair, which was kind of like the expected option, and that's what Glue expected. But I don't know. Well, how's here's the thing though. How's Kirby gonna challenge fair? Uh, back air afterwards? I don't know. Yeah, but that that assumes that he can get in that space quick enough afterwards. Imagine Meta Knight's fading yeah, back mean, with the fair. Fair was safe. Like he didn't get punished for it, but. Dimensional Cape would have killed. That's all I'm saying. Fair enough. But he gets it anyway. He's at 84. That was, it's actually so hard. Okay, yeah, Dexter is... That was weird. Dexter is reading Glue's uh, combo breaker Nairs out of his down throw now. Glue should probably start DIing away. Yeah. Or, like, if he wants to get into the, like, really heavy mind games, he can DI in and then wave dash back out of hit stun. Or out of, like, I don't know, falling down. Oh, uh, he's, he's dead, dead, right? No, he's oh, Meta Knight. No. He'll be fine. <laughs> Glue dies instead. Don't forget, this is the character that in Brawl could recover from the corner of the screen with no jumps. Yeah. I mean, it's... it's he's not quite the same level here, but his recovery is no slouch. <laughs> yeah. Okay, weak back air. Up B. Okay, Ooh, nice. Gets him. That The timing on that is actually really tough. It is. To ledge yeah, hog he, the side B. Yeah, and he actually did, like, the neutral ledge get up, too, which made it even harder. I think he did it. Yeah, it was a neutral, neutral get up. Yeah, Dexter knows to DI away on forward throw always. Otherwise, Kirby gets uh, off air or like first hit fair or something. Oh, that's scary. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I was gonna say that is so scary. Okay, Glue. I was saying earlier that uh, he up tilts shields a lot and he doesn't grab shields enough. But uh, he up tilted once and then grabbed. So. I guess Good he's following, following my advice that he probably never heard. <laughs> Just me. Oh, get some of the pivot F smash again. Eamon's too good, man. Nobody can beat him except Evan Page. Disregarding the skill level of these players, what do you think about the matchup itself? Uh, it's probably pretty bad for Kirby. I mean, he has no disjoint. Yeah. And Meta Knight's more mobile. And yep. Any Kirby's advantage of gimping doesn't really come into play against I feel Meta like Knight. you could probably describe this matchup as Meta Knight is Roy, but he can grab a crouching Kirby, and he has three jumps and a better recovery, and better edge guarding, and better kills. Yeah, I know. It's, it, it, it's awful. <laughs> it's very scary. <laughs> I mean, I, I've heard PM Meta Knight be described as, like, flying sword puff chic or something. <laughs> it's just like... Well, he has attributes of every top tier character from Melee. He has Marth and Roy's down tilt at the same time. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It's so He good. has like a Marth up air with no end lag and also three jumps. Yep. Woo. His Nair is indescribable though. That's his own thing. Oh, I'll describe the Nair. Don't you <laughs> Don't get me started. <laughs> I'll describe the hell out of the Nair. <laughs> I always like saying that Meta Knight's Nair is like an A tier character. <laughs> just, Nair just the Nair. Uh, it is frame free. Yep. I tested. I checked. Don't, oh, it don't is. worry. It definitely is. Frame three covers his whole body and then some. 
can yeah. kill edge guard combo, defend him out of shield, yeah, and has probably approach too. Weak hits, strong hits, <laughs> and lingers. Yeah, it's it's a good move. I would argue it's one of the best in the game. And then you put it on this super mobile character. Who has three jumps. Who has no three less. jumps and can ledge hop Nair and edge guard just about anything. Invincible ledge hop Nair. <laughs> Frame three. Imagine if Luigi's Nair covered his entire body. Oh, God. Like, that's this move. It's the same speed. I hate that he can do that. Just yeah. re reverses up B and get back. Yeah, you'd think his vertical recovery is not so good until you learn about that. Yep. Then, then he has suddenly... a mix-up between that and, like, down B to ledge. Right. It's it's incredible because you could be... Yep, there's the there. Gets the reverse edge guard. You could be holding the ledge, ready to edge guard Meta Knight. He fast falls low and does an up B onto the stage, and now he's edge guarding you because you're holding the ledge, and now he okay, has the stage. Okay, thank God that killed. I was going to say... That would have sucked that if Dexter lived. Like, he had good DI, but man. Yeah, even Dreamlight can't save you from that one. So, uh, yeah, what does Kirby do when Meta Knight is dash dancing and down tilting safely? What do you do? Uh, I don't know what DK does. I, like, run up shield and try to shield grab his down air. Run up shield it can work sometimes, but, the, you know, Dexter you have to worry like, about the grab. Because yeah, he has Dexter the grab, grabs, too. And he spaces his down tilt. Uh, he's dead. But glute, nah, glute's alive. Got him. I don't think Dexter really cares anymore. He's no. ahead by so much. Yeah. Uh, isn't it? Is it 2-0 or is it 1-0 still? I think it's 2-0. I'm not sure, actually. It's just been Dexter winning the whole time. Oh! Oh, gets him low enough. All, All right. right. You gimped Meta Knight. You've done the impossible, Glue. <laughs> All right. Swallow side. Go for the swallow side. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah he doesn't have any jumps. But he makes it back. God, neutral is just so painful in this matchup. Yeah, against Dexter too. It's just Kirby's got do. nothing he can really do. I feel Plank like the ledge, I guess. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Oh yeah, he's going for it. Kind of half-hearted attempt, but you know why not? Ooh. Oh, yeah, reverse up. E. Oh. Oh my God. He was too high to do it. Get out, played. <laughs> so that was three SDs. Sometimes well, you just get out skilled, you know. Two SDs plus uh, Gimp. That was probably Dexter's fault. We'll take it, though. Oh, God, not this song. Is this KK Bling? Is this... Or wait, is, is it, it actually? I know they used to have it on this setup. I don't know if it is. I think it is. This yeah, is Sam, Sam right is nodding. Now? This is KK Bling. I'm glad RTO is moving away. <laughs> that was mean. <laughs> <laughs> He dug his own grave when he put this song on the setup, dude. Was it Sam? It might have been Josh. That's incredible. Uh, why didn't he grab ledge there? Was he holding down? He might have been. He might have just why undershot though? a little bit. Why? I don't know. He got uh, battlefielded by Smashville. Even good players can miss the input sometimes. Yeah, but, I mean, whatever. Okay, he gets it. Down Maybe air's too slow. Slipped. Yeah, this is definitely KK Bling. Oh my god. It's one of those songs that's like oppressively catchy. <laughs> Where deep down, I mean like on the surface, you're just like, this is awful. But like on deep down on the inside, your brain is like, that's Yeah, this the song stuff. is going to be stuck in my head for the rest of the night. Oh. Ooh, nope, Meta Knight. Meta okay. Knight side B's hitboxes are that was, quite That was large. a really good fadeaway fair by Glue, because I was expecting a fall down air. So was Dexter. He was trying to shield grab, but Glue was too smart for it. I like that escape option. After he gets the spot dodge and he doesn't have much he can do, he just pops away with the flying air. Yeah. Oh, he could have punished that. I think Lou was scared of the shield grab if he was too late, but yeah, he could have gotten it. Ooh. Ooh, we got the balloon. Man, they have some really tight spacing going on right now. I like it. Oh my god. That was like two perfect shields within 10 seconds or so. Oh. Fades away after the the rock. Ooh, nice one. He couldn't get to the ledge in time. Okay, roll behind. Ooh, <laughs> just throw it out there. It's so hard to react to that. And it's so do, stressful. Yeah. Because like, if you if you react to it, thirty-three percent on a Kirby. Like, come on, that was like uh, three or four up airs and then an air. 
Up air does too much damage for how weak it is. Yeah. And how easy it is to combo. I hate getting comboed by nothing but up air. I'm like furiously SDIing down, <laughs> SDIing up. I'm like, I'm DK. I can't like get down. He's too this. big. Ooh, big combos. Can't spot dodge that. God. Didn't quite DI what? that. Down B is so good. It's a DI mix up. Because like, uh, if you're in the neutral and he throws down B, if you like shield or run away, and he doesn't do it, now he's just got more stage control. Yeah, and if he does it in the middle of a combo when he's like, like he can do fair to fair to down B, and then you're either too far off stage to live, or you're trying to DI away to get out of the fairs. <laughs> yeah, and then you die either way. It sucks. It's a good move. Ooh, nice ledge him. grab. He that barely some, didn't land yeah, on the Yeah, I was going to say, that was some tight timing, too, to get the ledge. Oh, that was close. That was actually really right. close. <laughs> yeah, Glue, Glue knew he was going to get caped there. Two jumps left, maybe? One? Yeah. Ooh, he called it. Nice. Dexter in Grand Finals to nobody. Nobody's surprised. Damn, that's well, rough. Well, uh, although Absent Page did lose early. So. Who did he? What? He lost to Omega. He went Sheik. Oh. Absent Page went Sheik. But okay. still, my Sheik was beating Omega in friendlies. Come on. My Sheik sucks. Absent Page's Sheik is, should be godlike. He probably just got uh, tilted by flying forward airs or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Sheik. The hitbox the that's like. I feel like if Ike <coughs> really, really wanted to, he could throw a forward air and hit someone in the setup next to him. <laughs> it probably transcends TVs. Glue says he hates that matchup. He uh, recommended that we blow his brains out. <coughs> I wish, man, if we had three headsets, that would be the, the greatest thing. That would be so cool. Just have Glue lean real close. Yeah. He should sit on your left, though, because the mic's right here. But whatever. All right, so we have uh, Karma versus Omega. So this must be for fifth.